Yeah, if you liked yesterday's weather, I think you're going to like what we have in store today. Okay. We have another day with quite a bit of sunshine in the forecast. We're already seeing those sunny skies here in Seattle and for much of Puget Sound. Let me take you out to Bellingham. Look at this shot right here. An absolutely beautiful start to the day. This is the Bellingham blue that Farah coined the other day. You can see we had that mixture of sun and clouds a little more in the way of sun this morning and going out to the waterfront. Good morning, Seattle. Beautiful start to the day here as well. We have the ferry that just docked. You can see the mountain in the background and it's a refreshing start to the day. 59 degrees. It's a little bit cooler than where we were yesterday. Those clear skies allow those temperatures to cool off just a little more efficiently. And we have temperatures ranging three to about six degrees cooler right now compared to yesterday morning. So you're feeling it out there. Maybe have that cup of coffee outside. Take that dog on a longer walk. 52 in Bremerton, 51 in Shelton. Let me take you up I-5. Good morning in Everett, 57, 55 in Bellingham. So a very refreshing start to the day. Now, while we have those clear skies here in Seattle. That's not the case everywhere. Take a look at the coast. We have that marine push that has worked its way in all the way through the Chehalis River Valley, and we have some visibility reduced due to that marine push. This will quickly burn off though by this afternoon, and temperatures are going to climb to near 70 for coastal areas. And as we work our way east across western Washington, we see those temperatures in the upper 70s to around 80 from Seattle south this afternoon. So just a touch above average and a little bit warmer than where we were yesterday. Everett North, those temperatures are going to be largely in the mid to upper 70s and temperatures continue to increase. So we saw that increase from yesterday to today. Those temperatures continue to increase as we start the work week. We're going to be near 90 Wednesday and Thursday. So we do start to heat up as we have this area of high pressure that's going to build over the region. And what this does is with that area of high pressure, it's a little bit heavier. There's more air, more atmosphere over the region that kind of weighs down. It compresses that air and then it warms up here at the surface. So that's why we're going to see those warmer temperatures as that area of high pressure builds over the region. And there's a lot going on today. It's going to be a nice day for two big matches we have in town. The rain, we have that match time at 12 p.m. Just around lunchtime, we have a temperature of 71 degrees climbing into the upper 70s. By the second half, we also have the sounders back at home a little bit of a later start to the match 7 p.m. Temperatures in the upper 70s falling into the upper 60s by the end of the match. Seven day forecast. We got a lot of 80s on there and a lot of sunshine. So get ready. Make sure you're wearing the SPF and staying hydrated, but overall not too bad of a week with those overnight lows falling into the upper 50s and lower 60s.